How are you? Hi. This is Allie with Teaneck Creek Conservancy, and this is another one of our series of snow mini crafts. So today we are going to be making little bird seed ornaments, which we can hang on outside trees outside our house. And these are going to be spectacular for providing a little bit of extra food for birds during the winter. So to get started with our ornaments, the things that we're going to need are ice cream cones. Maybe you have some of these left over from summer. If not, you can grab some over at the grocery store. They have some, I know for a fact, in ShopRite. Uh, we are going to need some peanut butter and we will need a hot glue gun, a little bit of string, and then wild bird seed. I chose a generic winter bird mix. So the first step in making our ornaments is that we are going to take our little, our little cones and we're going to put a little dab of hot glue on them and we're going to attach our string in a little loop. dot of that and I'm going to make my string just like this because we're going to use this to hang up our ornament outside. It's a little hard to see because I'm also wearing red. <laughs> okay perfect so I'm going to attach this right on and then the other side and then I'm just going to use anything I have. I have a knife handy so I'm just going to use that to press it on and make sure it's on nice and firm. Okay so I'm going to give that one second to dry but our next step is that we're gonna to wanna to make a sticky surface on our cone. So that's what we're gonna use our peanut butter for. So I chose a fully creamy natural peanut butter, um, one that was pretty liquid. You don't want one that's gonna to be too chunky or anything because it'll be very hard to spread. Like this, get our knife, and you're gonna to wanna to have a plate or maybe some newspapers nearby, especially if you're doing this project with kids because it can get a little bit messy with the peanut butter. So I'm going to take a little bit of peanut butter, I'm going to stir it around, make sure it's good. And I'm going to add on a thin layer all across my cone. You want to make sure you get all the way up to the top as high up as you can. Otherwise you'll have a bald spot on your ornament. Okay. And just slowly rotate as you spread it. That way you get every side and just leave your fingers right at the top. So you don't peanut butter all over yourself. Perfect. A little bit more. Right there. Okay. Now you can just go through with any extra peanut butter. You can just smooth out, make sure it's even. Then we're going to take our bird seed and we're going to put it into a big container like this that has enough space to roll around our room. Put a bit in here. Any extra that we have left over in this bin, when we're done with this, we can just throw outside. So don't worry about wasting it. We're going to use it no matter what. So we're going to take this again by the top and we're going to gently lay it down in our bird seed. Make sure we press it nice and firm and give a small rotation. Press it down again. Beautiful. And I'm just going to keep rotating it until it's covered with the bird seed. This is a nice bird seed mix. I can see it has a lot of sunflowers in it, some nice cracked corn, some really pretty, nice stuff. Okay. And then I'm just going to go back over and I'm going to sprinkle a little bit extra on and try to get any patches that may be missing some. Perfect. And so this right here is my finished product. Let me bring it closer so you guys can see. Okay, hold on. There we go. Oh, it's spinning a little bit. Okay. And this is awesome. This is a really cool ornament for outside because the majority of it is going to break down or be eaten. So this is spectacular. You should also Try to use a thread that is very noticeable because I'm going to, after the birds eat this, I'm going to go back and I'm going to recollect my thread, bring it back inside. Yeah, that way I don't leave any waste outside. But yeah, spectacular. It's always good to save a little bit extra food for birds during the winter. I know they have some trouble when there's not as much food. So thank you guys so much. I hope that you make this craft. And if you do, please post it on our page. We'd love to see. All right. Thanks, guys.